doing good. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get him. Get him. Up. Up. Fight him back out. That'll work. Woo! <laughs> nice job. Oh my gosh. Oh, dude, that's. When that thing hit, I was like, I'm not letting this thing get away. Woo! All right, let's get it in there. 16, all right. Oh yeah, that's easily 14. Holy crap. You're like, well, let's just move up a little further. I was like, well, I want to take at least one out here. One little cast. All right, dude, sweet. All right. Nice, dude, nice, nice. nice. Did you get three of those? Yep, let's get like two more bigger. <laughs> Yeah. Right. Yeah. That's the thing with frogging is my hands get so wet. And I can't get a grip on my reel very well. It's really tight to those tall weeds in the back. Yeah. It's too much current for them. That's why I think they. They, they have to be really tight to those weeds, otherwise they're not going to sit there. Like right on them. Uh huh. The bee landed on my wrist and got away. Don't need that. You got your bee thing in here? Yep. Oh, get him. Uh, Got off. It was a little, it was a little guy. From what I saw. Crap. This current sucks too because my line went in that wood. You got, it. you got to pick up, dude. You got two seconds. Pick up the line, reel it up to slack, and then the camera. What do you mean? That was too quick of a, of a jerk. Too what? Too quick of a jerk. You got a lot more time. That was a hit. It's true. You got all the two seconds. One, two, just uh, take your time. I mean, I saw a jump. I don't, I don't think it was that big. <laughs> that turtle trying to climb that piece of wood going up. Oh. Look at them. <laughs> no, it's holding on. They got those little claws, but it's holding on for dear life. I think there's better options around. In my humble opinion. Sounds like a log. A rock. Got him. Big one. Get the net. Okay, maybe not. Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hold him, hold him, hold him. Yes. Oh. The oh. weeds made him feel a lot heavier. Oh, this is just feeling. No fun. <sighs> oh man. Just when I was getting desperate. Mm -hmm. Holy cow, you hook them on the outside. Yeah, I tried to do that. Hold on, hold on. Got a good grip? Mm hmm. Okay. Mm hmm. 15. Well, hopefully, we need to let him go later. You're like, get the net. I'm like, dude, you're on it. I was like, <laughs> like standing on it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah right. get the net. I was pulling so many weeds through there. I was like, oh yeah, this is an 18, 19. Oh, no. <laughs> I did that yesterday with that little 15 inch I caught. Yeah. And I pulled him out and by the time he got the boat, now he only hit less than you and me to the dock away. I couldn't even see, I saw the fish. I thought the fish was gone. I thought it just had weeds. Oh. It was buried in weeds. 
Yep. Well, and I pulled everything off. I was like, oh, there's a fish. And a big fish on a frog took it down. I reeled it in, dag out the net. He got the fit. He got like he netted it, and then we took all the weeds away, and there was no fish. Really? Because the weeds were so heavy, we thought I was fighting the fish. There's another one. Probably chasing bait fish. I'll try going in from this angle. Nope. It's probably a 10 inch or where. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, watch if you see a pile of nothing. Wow. I mean, that tree is great because that's why the fish is there to begin with. Well, and it, it does offer some kind of protection. Yeah. yeah. See? That was probably the first frog that fish went for today, I bet. Oh my gosh, Chris. You can't cast it to the left. Why don't you get a real rod and maybe you figure it out? Right. I'll no, I down. can't either. That's probably my problem because I'm not used to the way this cast yet and I know that. We gotta get a little closer, Chris. Really? Yep. Really? Something. You actually caught the ones you're swinging at? You'd be okay. You know what? It's like Dan. I'm not good at hitting the deer, maybe getting the fish, but I'm really good at finding them. I don't even think it had it. It was a really clean release, so. Okay. Your duck wants, then you can cast. Okay, or you can cast. Oh no. Crap. The way you set the hook on it, it snap. <laughs> Look out. You hear that splash? Hit the deck. Mm. Now, now, hit him. No. Oh. Oh. It was like five feet oh, to the gosh. left. Your line looked like it. The line of your line was following. I couldn't see the. I was like, oh. did I get a hit and that happened at the same time? No, I, I looked at your line like straight off the rock. Oh, you thought it was. It going like straight. I was like, dude, I don't see your frog. It's gone. <laughs> yeah, those are probably just panfish playing. Yeah. Or a bass is following my frog and they got freaked out because they saw it or something. Or it's a five pounder that, you know, doesn't matter. Mm-hmm. Probably not. I think it's the first one. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed that one. We sure had a really fun time. It was a really fun day on the water. It was kind of a struggle, but not overall too bad considering the people we talked to back at the landing. When we registered our fish, we registered two legal fish. We had a third one, but we had to let it go just because it was 13 and a half inches, not quite 14. In Wisconsin, they need to be 14 to keep in your boat and to register. So we ended up only with two fish out of three. We talked to some people at the landing, actually quite a few. Some people said they didn't catch any fish. Actually, the majority of people we talked to, so it was a really hard day on the water. One person next to us on the dock, he said he caught one fish and that was it. Another guy I talked to caught five fish, but they were all below 14 inches, so he couldn't register any of them. And then when Chris went to register the two fish we did catch, or the person in charge told us that had we caught another legal fish at the time we registered, that would have put us in second place. But since we didn't have three fish, it's extremely hard to compete in a three fish tournament. We caught two instead of three. We had a really fun time. Next year, it's gonna be even better. This is our second time ever fishing that lake. So I think we did quite well. I don't know where we ranked. Definitely not in the top five, probably somewhere in the middle. All right, as always, take care. Also, subscribe, share, and like.